There is a crisis developing in a local small town. The town's major employer is <laughs> it's dropping a bomb, announcing it's closing down, sending 80 jobs to China. It's in Caledonia, in the southeastern corner of the state, and the company is Mikan Sports. It makes equipment for Major League Baseball. Yeah, tomorrow, Minnesota U.S. Senator Tina Smith is getting directly involved, trying to save the plant and trying to save those jobs and probably the town along with it. ABC 6 News reporter Devin Martin went there to talk with those affected and those trying to stop it. I think it's horrible. We've got a lot of people that live in town. People in Caledonia are upset. They don't want to see the plant close and the workers lose their jobs. I can only say that I, I hope the, the politicians fight hard and that they, uh, they understand that the fight is to save uh, the jobs for the people of uh, small town America. And politicians are stepping in to try and stop it from happening. I spoke to Adam Swan, the Caledonia city administrator. He says earlier this month, someone who works at the plant told the city the plant was closing in 18 to 24 months. And we understand it's a major concern, and we understand this is going to have a big impact on uh, not only the, the employees who are there, but the you know, members of the community. And so, you know, we're doing everything we can to try and change their change their mind. Minnesota Senator Tina Smith wrote this letter urging Major League Baseball to reverse their decision to close the plant. I think it's outrageous that Major League Baseball and this private equity firm are moving this business out of Caledonia and shipping jobs to uh, China. Minnesota U.S. Representative Jim Hagedorn agrees. He said on Twitter, I am incredibly disappointed that Mike in Sports intends to shut down most operations at its Caledonia plant and move jobs to China. Representative Greg Davids of Preston agrees too. This plant needs to be saved. You know, normally I wouldn't get involved in uh, a private business, but what this business is doing is so wrong and they need to reverse their uh, direction on this issue. And for the people in town, they're glad people are fighting to keep this plant and those jobs in town. I don't know what effect they'll have in their fight, but I'm glad somebody's trying to do something. So as political leaders try and figure out what to do next, the people here in Caledonia are hopeful that this business is here to stay. In Caledonia, Devin Martin, ABC6 News.